All right, let's solve this together. It says x to the power x minus four, which the power of four is equal to x to the power of four. We are going to solve for x in this question. Okay, first thing we can do is to um, push this over to this side, or let's subtract x raised to the power of four from both sides. So we say that this is x minus four raised to the power of four minus x to the power of four. If we subtract x to the power of four from the opposite side, it becomes zero. Now, moving on from here, we can say that this is x to the x minus 4 to the power of 2 multiplied by 2 minus x to the power of 2 multiplied by 2 is equal to 0. Alright? Now, we're going to write this as x minus 4 to the power of 2 raised to the power of 2 minus x raised to the power of 2 raised to the power of 2 to be equal to 0. Okay? Now, this is difference of 2 squared. So, we can say that x minus 4 squared plus x squared multiplied by x minus 4 squared minus x squared would now be equal to 0. Now, this is sum of two squares. Now, law sum of two squares says that a squared plus b squared is equal to a plus bi multiplied by a, sorry, this is a minus bi. Now, when you have two things multiplying to give you zero, it's either the first one is equal to zero or the second one is equal to zero. So it's either that x minus 4 squared plus x squared is equal to zero. Applying this law of the sum of two squares here, we have that this is x minus 4 plus x multiplied by i multiplied by x minus 4 minus x multiplied by i. So this is equal to 0. Again, it's either that x minus 4 plus xi is equal to 0. Implying that we have x plus xi to be equal to 4. This is x into 1 plus i is equal to 4. We have x to be equal to 4 divided by 1 plus i. Rationalize this denominator. Multiply here by 1 minus i. And multiply the denominator by 1 minus i. 4 into 1 minus i divided by... This is law of difference of two squares. So we can say 1 squared is 1. We have minus... i squared is minus 1. So we have minus times minus 1 is plus 1. This is equal to 4 multiplied by 1 minus i divided by 2, which is equal to 2 into 1 minus i. Okay, so this is the first answer for x here. The second part of this equation says that x minus 4 minus xi is equal to 0. We can say that this is x minus xi to be equal to 4. Now, from here, we can factor out x so that we have x into 1 minus i to be equal to 4. We can now say that our x is equal to 4 divided by 1 plus 1 minus i. Rationalizing the denominator, we have this to be multiplied by 1 plus i. And here's to multiply by 1 plus i. So that we have that this would be 4 into 1 plus i divided by, again, this is equal to, the denominator is equal to 2. So this is equal to 2 into 1 plus i. Moving on from here, let's bring in the second part of this equation. So the equation says x minus 4 squared minus x squared is equal to 0. This is law of difference of two squares. So we can now say that this is x minus 4 plus x multiplied by x minus 4 minus x is equal to 0. Okay, x minus 4 plus x equals 0 will then be equal to 2x minus 4 equals 0. Hence, x here is equal to 2. Or, x minus 4 minus x is equal to 0. And this cannot give us any answer. Hence, our answers for x is that x is equal to 2 into 1 plus i, comma, 2 into 1 minus i, comma, or 2. So these are the three answers for x in this question.
Thanks for watching. See you guys in my next video. What's going on, guys? It's watching your editing this video. As you can see, about 99% of you guys are not subscribed to the channel. So please subscribe, like, comment, and share my videos. As this helps to push my videos out to more viewers out there. The more you subscribe, the more viewers can see my videos. The more we grow in this community. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in my next video.